We're gonna factor this trinomial and looking at this, I see we have a leading coefficient other than one. So I'm gonna set my two sets of parentheses and now realizing that my first two spots here could be 4x and x or 2x and 2x. So I'm going to try 2x and 2x because I usually try the two numbers closest together. Uh, and now my other two factors here could be nine and one, or perhaps three and three. And I can tell if I have nine and one, that that's gonna be two X on the outside and 18 X on the inside. And I cannot get 15 X from two X and 18 X. So I'm gonna look to change those to make that a three and a three. So that gives us six X on the outside and six X on the inside. Now again, I can't get 15 X from that. So I am not going to use then three and three. And I'm gonna go back and erase my two X and two X and make it four X and one X. And obviously doing this sometimes gets a little tedious. Um, but if I try three and three again, I get 12 X on the outside and three X on the inside. And so if that was a positive 12x and a positive 3x, that would give me 4x squared as I FOIL this out, plus 12x on the outside, plus 3x on the inside, and plus 9, giving me my 4x squared plus 15x plus 9. So this is our answer that we will put in the box.